Damn dude, just got the ban in CSGO because I hacked balls deep. Let's see if I can get my ban removed. ban removed. Okay, quite a bit of attention I see. Let's see if this guy actually got his ban removed just before uh, anything's happening. Okay, okay, this faggot still has a ban. Mm-hmm. Yeah, I dislike this video. Oh yeah, dude. You say you got them guns, but I've never seen you bang. You say you got them drugs, but I've never seen you slang. You say you Yo, what is up guys, my name is Matt and welcome to a new video on Pixar. Today's video, I'm going to talk to you guys about my VAC ban. And there's a big, big, big misconception about it. Because after I made that video, which kind of went viral and got shared around a lot, I got a lot of attention because of that, and that's why my channel exploded. Uh, people think I am still banned on CSGO. Because I get it, you see the video, you think, how did this guy get his VAC ban removed? You go to his profile and you see there's still a VAC ban. I mean, that's quite unlikely, right? I've gotten the VAC ban 300 days ago exactly today. So, the VAC ban I've got is for Black Ops 2. It's also in my Steam description. And if you have looked further than... Um, if you have looked further than only just my profile and the VAC ban uh, exclamation thingy, then you might as well have seen that my items in CSGO are still tradable. Uh, my description in my profile says that I'm not banned in CSGO. It's for Black Ops 2. And people on the YouTube video have also commented it. And people have also blamed me for that I'm still VAC banned and CSGO. They clearly did not do their research or uh, they were just so mad that they didn't even care. They just want to blame me for it. Yeah, how I got VAC banned is pretty stupid reason. Because um, I, I actually used mods. I I'm not afraid to say that. In Black Ops 2, I used to be a trick shotter. If you don't know what trick shotting is, it's just spinning around with a sniper and trying to hit people. But if you have mods on Black Ops 2 on the PC, you can just do f uh, way more cooler things. You can do like Superman lobbies or uh, just special features and trick shots. And I think it was a really fun time doing it. But once you get fact banned, it's just all over. Honestly, it's not the first time I'm getting banned in BO2 because I've gotten banned for this mod quite some times. I still haven't learned from it. I mean, now I have because I don't play the game anymore. But I've gotten banned for this mod like three times now or something. And I don't really care because it's a deserved ban and yeah, it's just completely my fault and I think it's fun to play with like that but you guys must know that I don't harm people with hacking or modding. I just had fun with friends and that's about it. So if you like this video, please drop a like and make sure to subscribe if you want to see more if you're not subscribed already. Uh, sorry for the not so good gameplay in the background, just couldn't get any better, I'm not really good at uh, b-hopping or anything. So. Uh, thanks for watching, and I'll see you guys later. Peace.